season is basically in full swing, which you know what that means. Hair tutorials, makeup tutorials, and just tons of festivals all summer long. So we've been basically scouring the internet and we've seen some crazy, crazy tutorials. Crazy tutorials and we were like, out there. that is impressive, but we wanted to do something that was a little bit more simple. So we decided to do two different makeup looks for you. Mine's more of like a golden goddessy kind of vibe, and I want kind of more of a purple vibe. Yeah, so these are super, super easy to recreate. So let's just get started. All right guys, so for my makeup look, I think I'm going to go for more of that like golden goddessy kind of vibe. So what I've already done, I've already done my face makeup, I've already done my brows. So I'm just going to go in and kind of touch up my eyes a little bit and add, of course, a ton of highlight and some jewels. So I've already started with my full foundation on and I kind of just have like a little bit of a brown smoky eye moment going on. If you guys wanna see like a full on tutorial of anything like that, maybe I'll do that for you in the future. Um, but everything will be linked down below too in case you're wondering what kind of products I have on my face. So I'm actually just gonna go in with my eyes and give them like a little bit of pizzazz because like, hello, it's festival season. You gotta be like totally extra, right? So I'm going in with these two little Pure Cosmetics. These are like liquid eyeshadow kind of things, but they're super pigmented and they look really, really good. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna actually mix these two colors together. This one is more of like a yellowy gold and this one is more of like a rose gold. So when you mix them together, you get like the perfect color. So I'm just going to kind of do that on the back of my hand really quick. And then I'm just going to apply it to my eye. I'm going to put this more towards the inner corner in the ball of my eyelid. That's gonna make you look like totally fly and pop out <laughs> the walls. <laughs> <laughs> what? And this is gonna give your eye like the best moment of like glitter of your life because when you're at a festival, um, there's so many people there. So the shinier you are, the easier you are to be spotted out of the crowd. <laughs> Right, like a diamond. The sparkly you are, you know, the more likely someone's gonna pick you out of a crowd. And you know, I've never been to Coachella or a festival or anything like that, but in case they do any kind of like contests, you're bound to win because they're just going to notice how sparkly you are, and that's gonna really set you apart from the entire crowd. Why are you laughing at me? Like I'm trying to film a serious video here. So I'm also going to take this kind of like on my inner corner a little bit and drag it underneath the lower lash line. But I'm keeping everything kind of in the inner corner because that's where it looks the best. All right, so now it's time to highlight this situation because this entire makeup look is basically based off of highlight and shininess and glitteriness. So I'm actually going to go in with the two golder tone shades golder tone, is that a word? From the Carly Bible palette. And we're just gonna keep working our way. This might take a minute, so you know, don't mind yourself if it does. All right, so now that I feel pretty snatched and drippy, um, I can't really take myself seriously any longer. I need to put on a little bit of a lip. So I'm going in with the YSL, what is this? This is the Rouge Volupte Shine. This is one of the best things ever if you're looking for something that's just going to last all day, be super comfortable, and just kind of be more of like a balmy gloss with like a little tiny bit of like a nude color. So I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of this. All right, so it is now jewel time. Um, Jordan? Assistant? Snapping <laughs> at me. I have um, my assistant on set with me here, um, gluing pre-eyelash gluing my jewels for me because that just makes things roll a lot um, easier. So if you can get yourself an assistant, a sister, a boyfriend um, to pre-lash glue any of your jewels, that'll make you getting ready for any festival or Coachella go so much quicker. <laughs> Hurry the f up. This is not as helpful as I thought it was, you guys. You know, sometimes hiring an assistant can be detrimental to your <laughs> situation because it actually take longer if you have to teach them what to do. You know what I'm saying? Wait. <gasps> yeah. See what I mean? It's, it's, so basically what I'm going to do is just take a couple of jewels and I'm going to kind of trace my eyebrows a little bit and then I think I'm going to stick some sort of star situation on the side. All right guys, so that was my take on my little festival look. Super easy, super glowy, and it just looks amazing. So let's hop right into Jordan's look. What's up guys, it's Jordan. So for my look, I basically already have my full face of makeup on and for my eyeshadow, I kind of went with more of a brown purpley look. I actually used the Carly Bible palette and I'm basically just gonna finish up my look and add a little bit of extra detail. So the first thing I'm gonna do is drench myself in highlight. I'm actually using this new Pure palette. This is the Goal A Digger palette and I'm using the Glow Getter highlight, which I'm obsessed with. So I'm gonna put this at the top of my cheekbones and I really love this highlight because it almost gives you like an iridescent glow. It's kind of that 
unicorn vibe. And I'm actually gonna bring this all the way up, kind of above my brow bone. And I'm also gonna bring it onto my cheek as well because I basically wanna be dripping in highlight. Before I get into the crazy jewels that I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and just put on a lip really quick. I'm gonna be using the Liquid Courage um, Classic Matte in the shade Toasted. This is just a matte lipstick. And since it is a festival season, I wanna be a little bit extra with this entire look. So I'm gonna go over that matte lip with a gloss. And this one's from Pure. This is the Queen of Hearts, which you guys know, this is like one of my favorite lip combinations. All right, you guys, so now for the fun part. So I went to the dollar store to kind of see what they had and I found these really cute little gems. And what I decided to do was kind of do like a DIY head crown type of situation. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go in with purple and clear. Kind of wanted to go for more of a purple vibe for this look. So I'm just gonna grab this crystal and they're kind of sticky, but I'm gonna go ahead and use some lash glue just because I don't want it to fall off during the festival or anything. So let's just see how this goes. So I really love the way this little headband situation turned out, but I wanted to take it one step further. So I decided to also glue a little moon and star situation on my face. So I grabbed this little cute purple moon. I'm gonna stick it right on kind of my temple area. And then I'm gonna put a star above and below it. All right, you guys, so this is basically my completed look, which is so outside the box from anything I've ever done, but I actually really love the way it turned out. All right, guys, so those were our two takes on our little festival makeup tutorial. And we were actually shook by the way they so turned shocked. out. We actually are obsessed, you guys. Yeah, we thought like maybe we'll actually make this like an everyday thing. And right? Just, like, start rocking. We're not even going to a festival, I don't think. And I'm like, maybe we should now because like this looks bomb. But if you guys want to see more festival looks or some hairstyles, definitely give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Love you guys. Bye.